Welcome back to another video. Today is a highly requested video on how I use Weeble. What does my Weeble look like? What do I have on there? And how do I use it to trade? So I get this question a lot of times, especially when I posted my live trade uh, recaps where I actually show my Weeble screen. People just want to know how I set everything up and just the overall functionality of my desktop. So starting off, we have our chart in the top left. I don't really use Weeble charts too much. I'd mark some key levels on it. But other than that, I only use the chart just to monitor the stock uh, when I'm in a play. For charts, I use TradingView and I have that up on the left hand side of my monitor. So this isn't really relevant to me. It's just to see how the stock is reacting. And I keep the EMAs on on this chart and not my normal trading view chart just to see how the market reacts to them. So this is my lesser. This is a lesser focus for me for Weeble. I don't really like using the chart too much. It's not very customizable. I personally just don't like it i like the trading view ones a lot better but um yeah chart getting the boring stuff out of the way down here we have the options chain so the options chain obviously is just so i can have the options ready if i want to hop into a play i right click hit send and then group cross layouts and that takes me to my order entries so you guys can see i actually have two and the reason i have two is the left one is always where i'm buying my contracts and the one on the right is always where i'm selling my contract so this one's always set at the bid this one one's always set at the asks ask so i can buy here and then sell here because what ended up happening when i first started out is i'd be in a play and i'd be looking to sell but i'd forget to click the sell part and then i'd buy more contracts and you guys know how bad that is and it's just not fun so just to stop that this is buy this is sell next thing we have is my time and sales so you guys know i'm a big advocate for uh time and sales and level two i actually have webinars posted on both of those uh on my youtube so you guys could go back and look at for those so you guys are going to be able to see how visible everything is for me i'm able to see time and sales here i'm able to see level two here at the same time i have my positions here and then obviously i don't have my account open just so i can show you guys but this is where i keep my positions open here's my buy here's my sell here's where i keep my position so when i'm in a position i can see everything and the only thing that i have in my positions tab is the amount of contracts i have and my fill price and what the contract is only three things i don't have my open pnl i don't have a percent pnl I don't have anything because I tend to notice when I'm in a play like that where I know or I see the red PL, I see the red percentage, it really messes with me. Um, not as much as it used to, but now I just prefer not to have and just trade strictly off the chart because I know I'm positioned properly and big red numbers used to scare me. They still do a little bit, so that's why I don't keep them on there. And then this is my orders. This is going to show your working orders, filled orders, your canceled orders. It's going to show all of that stuff. So if I'm in a position and it didn't fill, then I can just modify it from the orders tab. So that's that's enough of me showing you guys the setup. I'm actually going to go and show you guys how you can actually make it. So when you're on Weeble, what you're going to do is you're going to come to the left and go to customized and you're going to click on new layout. So you can use any of this stuff. Are right, you guys can come here? You can hit blank layout. And what you're going to be presented with is a plethora of widgets. So for me, what I like to do is I like to find the chart and we're going to find the chart rate. So here we have the chart and this is how I set it up. I have it set up to like around halfway through this screen not really because the chart isn't really what i'm looking to trade because i have my chart on my trading view and while we're here we'll get the order book ready put the order book here we could go into the time and sales grab that and we'll work on the sizing of everything later uh, i just want to show you guys everything i use so the next thing is the classic trade you want to get two of these bad boys and one's going to be your buy one's going to be your sell next thing you want to do is get your account positions and that's going to go over here next thing you want to do is you want to go and grab your options chain put it down here and scroll it down and we're just gonna work on fixing up our sizing of everything which really isn't important but you guys know what I mean the main things you really need are just this and people always get confused with the widgets and stuff like that so that's why I'm making this right now and you guys can see this one I have everything superimposed but here is just like the nitty gritty, nothing too big, nothing too small. This layout is pretty much what I go for. And if you guys have a lot of real estate on your <clears throat> monitor, what you're able to do is make it as big as you want, as small as you want, and really focus on whatever. Me personally, <clears throat> this is this is what I use. It's very, very simple. I'm not going to make this tutorial too long, but this is literally what it comes down to. You have your orders, you have everything. So the best part about this is the reason I like Weeble desktop a lot more than say Thinkorswim or whatever is I have everything in one place. No other platform that I've ever used 
has been able to give me the chart, the options chain, the time and sales, the level two, two different order entries, and my positions all in one single space. And that's why I love Weeble, and I'm not sponsored by them, guys. I'd love to be, actually. But this is why I use Weeble, is because I could see everything in one space. I don't have to flip between tabs. I just have everything in one place. I know where everything is, and I know it works. And this is why I use Weeble um, out of any other broker. When people ask me, yo, what broker do I use? This is why. This desktop is amazing. And on your phone, you're able to use big buttons so this is how i set up my weeble hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial um i don't want to make it too long i'm not here to waste your guys time i'm here to give you guys information and then you guys are able to use it so if you guys enjoyed tweet me on twitter if you guys use this uh weeble layout drop a like let's try getting 200 likes on this video and then comment if you're going to be using this layout i'll see you guys in the next one peace